have a look and let me think I can I think, think of about having it or something. Because this is not moving. This is not moving at all. Is there is a weld right there. I'm not sure how they got this thing in. But anyway, I'm going to cut it off there. That's yeah. Anyway, all right, let me grab it. Anyway, but uh, yeah, I've got some. What have we gone? Yep, I'm going to have to cut that off, I think. So uh, let's um, explore what we're doing here before we get drastic. So that shift uh, was welded on. Go yeah, that way. Um, you'll have to cut that off, I think. Right there. Yeah. That was a good start. It's pretty hard doing this one-handed. You know what I'm doing. I'll get back to you. They came off. Um, pretty much right on the weld. What are there, two welds? No, just the one. All right, now I can actually drop that back down without having to worry about that um, clearing. Let's go and jump the car up. Or we'll jack the car up, I should say. Yeah. Right, the car is jacked up now, so it's not really a lot of <laughs> to any back room like hood. Um, so what I need to do now is to get some things to put underneath the gearbox. That's uh, going to let it drop a bit without causing damage. So I've got heaps of crap around here. So I need a pocket button box, but you sort of cleanish. Ah, this must be good, Robert. So what I need to do now is... There's a box there. I need to undo the mounts. Oh, so the bolts too. Gearbox mount and also undo what that bolt's missing. So I might jack this up first, take out the support, and then undo one, two, three, four bolts. Uh, sorry, nuts. Um, no, yeah, nuts. Uh, doing the gearbox, and let's see how we go from there. I'll come back in a sec. So let's remove. I'll oh, jack it up. Jack the transmission a bit. Let's remove the support. Now I can't remember if Tony and I sort of dropped this out before. No, none on that. And there's, I think, none on that. No, it's not. All right. So, this we should support out. Uh, there we go. So the train's just uh, free floating there. So I just need to remove those four. Complete nice line come out. Just drop it down gently on the jack. Not much fun doing this by yourself. I don't have any choice. Did I remove? No. Okay, I need to remove. A speedo linkage. 
All right, let's get some. <laughs> let's get some gear to take it off. Hang on. Grab one of my favorite tools now. Just uh, side wrench. Where do you like to call it? Rabbi. Friend. Thing. All right, half inch. Let's get in and get those. Um, bumped out. Well, nuts out. Really hard to do with one hand. <laughs> so there's four of them. That's one. Listen to. This four. There's one up there as well. Alright, I'll get back to you. Let's do all four. Hang on. Get all four. I'll tell you. Um, you can't really see much. But, um, there's the two on this side and the two on the other side. And so, what I might do now is work out why the freaking hell my batteries don't work that well. And because um, all the new ones have gone over to the other place. Get a light in here. All of the transports are out. You line here and wiggle this thing out because it's jack right up at the moment. And um, yes, let's get this old gearbox out of here. Let's see what we're doing now. Um, we've got uh, those with the bolts that I took out one, two, three, four on the other side. Jacked up the transmission. The reason why I've got the light in now as opposed to before was because I didn't have enough battery for it because all the batteries are over at the other, the other house. So what I need to do now is let this jack down slightly and pull the gearbox out. Which is going to be fun. Anyway, needs to be done. Come on, Jack. Everything's so much more fun with one hand. Right. I've done this up rather tight. Hang on. Are you going to sit there while I do this? Camera's on the wrong side, but anyway, that's better. Box a bit. Are you going to wiggle out? Here's my next question, or should I just drop the whole thing down first? There we go. Yep. I should just wiggle out, but I think the camera and the jack are in. Well, jack's in the position. I think I might pick. and just not let you fall on me. <laughs> or is this going to get in the way? Just bite the bullet and pull it out. Let's see what those cables carrying on. This has been melted by the freaking exhaust. And of course, being in Australia, everything's biting at the moment because it's night time. And ow. Oh, gearbox. Gearbox fluid coming out of. That's what killed it. Gearbox fluid coming out of manual transmission. Yeah, that's that's fucking choice. Well, apologies for the swearing, but that's what killed you. Um, if you like, just let drip on the. Yeah, I'll let you drip. All right. Come on, let's see what we can do here. Hang on the other side. Oh, camera angles. Yeah. 
No, they're not going to pull this, but I can have them out. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Come on, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Ah, damn, it's going to be dropped down a bit, I think. Ah, there we go. Come on. Off that spline. Ah, yeah, well, I knew you'd do that. Let's find something a bit easier with the phone slash camera. Just checked up here and it looks like it's going to maybe clear. Um, is that what's hitting against? Didn't I cut that off long well enough? Uh, this hump's been put in the wrong spot. This is going to be fun. Let's jiggle and wiggle and try and get this off. Well, I seriously think this hump's been put in the wrong spot. All right, here we go. You're on a stand now, so let's see how this works from a up top perspective and also down as well. I think we're gonna have a bit of pain getting this out. <coughs> so, anyway, without pain, there's no gain. Moving a little bit, softly down slightly. Supposed to be in all day. Drop it on my head. Fuel uh, uh, below there now. Yep. Just drop that down on the jack. That's interesting how much freaking automatic transmission fluid is pissing out of a manual gearbox. Which I've got some great mess there. Better cable, those of you who can't see any of you, which is pretty much everyone, is going in there and has a retaining nut, a bolt there. So I'll take this out and that's what I'm dealing with. And yeah, there we go. Oh, can you see? No. Right. I'm playing with. Anyway, I'll come back and you can stand up. No, <laughs> you're facing the wrong way. Hang on. Let's see what I'm doing. Right, let me go and grab something to prize it out with. And my pry bar is not here. So it's not the house. Well, it's going to be long screwed on, shall we? also been taken away. Alright. Uh, okay. Well the screwdriver I can muster up right now. And that, that is really fun because all of that transmission fold we shouldn't have been here in the first place. It's all pissing over my... Um, uh, come out. That's not holding it for me. Uh, uh, take the 
think I'm at. It's holy. All right, let me get back to you. It's breezy today, and it's getting lighter. All right. It's better I cable coming out now. <sighs> yeah, it's too hard to grab the camera. I can only hear. I do everything because I don't have a lift. <laughs> well, I do, but I have one here. Get a knot on the outside, and then they no longer feel like working properly. Uh, you're supposed to be out. Come on. Holding you in there. Whacking me. Just want to be spun a bit. Hello. You're in this happy spot. Uh, if anything can be called a happy spot right now. Blowing up. I'll get you fixed, but I'll put you through pain first, you bastard. <sighs> sure, if you're going to cause me too much pain first, getting so close, why is that spider cap coming out? Okay. 
coming. Yeah, it's a bit interesting doing this without. Sorry about that. You can't have that much to go. I need <clears throat> a few things here. far as I can for this evening, everything's going flat and I really need to get that spare cable out. We could uh, do that. So that's me signing off, I think, for this evening because I need to clean up. I would actually go to sleep and work tomorrow. <sighs> Alright. Oh, it's frustrating. Frustrating for me too. That's it.